Hello, hello, Tatum here and welcome back. It's day three of our 12 days of fitness challenge. Your goal is to complete a workout 12 consecutive days in a row through the 31st. I have a cardio pyramid workout for you. We'll add an exercise each round and then work back down. It's fun, quick, and sweaty. No equipment is needed. So grab your water bottle and towel and let's get to it. All right, hello, it's time to get started today. And I'm so excited to share this cardio workout with you. It's a sweater, you're gonna sweat, you're gonna feel it. So let's get ready, make sure you have your towel and water nearby. Let's start with a light jog. Just bringing up that heart rate, heart rate, <laughs> waking up. This is day three of our fitness challenge. I'm calling this Run Run Rudolph today, <laughs> just because we're doing some lateral run, runs today. Let's go ahead and start there nice and slow. We're gonna go back and forth, depending on your space today. Good, we're gonna warm up very quickly because this is cardio. Just making sure we're a little loose and ready to go. If you need more of a warm up, remember to always pause and take that time. We're all different when it comes to what we need to get started for the day. All right, good, let's go ahead and cross over, touch your toe, really open up wide, get a good, good twist here to the outside of that foot. Good, back and forth. Give me three more, three, two, and one, nice work. We're gonna inchworm out, want us to walk out all the way to a high plank, give it a jump in and out, and then bring it back in. Good, back out. Let's give it two jacks. One, two, back in. And out for three. One, two, three, in. Good, you can step those out too. Out, one, two, three, four, back in. Nice work. Some arm circles here. Real quick, we're getting ready to start in about 20 seconds. Two bumps and a reach, we're gonna move through quickly, 30 second intervals. Starting with a crossover uh, tap here with the butt kick, so here we go, five seconds. Just start low, get the movement right here, cross behind, kicking that heel up, kind of like a butt kick, but they're crossing over, and then we're gonna bring it up, 30 seconds, here we go. 30 seconds working. Alternate those taps. Boom, boom, you got it. Take it high. We will have 30 second rest between each of my circuits here. And we're just adding an exercise on to each one of these. You'll see here, three, two, one. Here we go, run it side to side laterally. All right, and you can stick it, good. Quick or slow, go as far as you want, depending on your space there in the room. Run it out. We rarely move side to side. I typically love to add a side to side movement when we work. Three, two, one, rest. Good work, take a sip if you want it. Okay, so this is the way this workout will go. Woo. <laughs> we're gonna start back at the beginning for the two exercises we just did, but then we're gonna tack one on. And the run will always end that circuit. So for this one, we'll do these crossover taps again behind. Then we're gonna add a push up with a kick, and then we'll run. And then we'll just keep adding on. So you'll see, here we go. Cross it over behind here, tap it out. Once you have that movement, if you're there, take it high. You can stay low today, 30 seconds here. We're just gonna keep moving. We're gonna really burn up the, the calories today with a nice high heart rate, but you can take any of these movements lower. And I'll give you those alternatives. Come on. You got it. Three, two, and one. Here we go. Come on down to your push-up position. I want a good push-up, knee or toes, and then come up and kick. 
or lift. Leg lift there. Push back into a little downward dog and lift that leg. Keep alternating. You got it. If this is too much, remember to modify, you can break it down and just work on push ups. Three, two, and one. Here we go. We're running. Remember, we're always going to end with the run. Side to side. Quick steps to the side. You can stick it. I kind of have squares on my mat, so I'm aiming for about four of these. You could just do four side to side. Time, good work. 30 seconds rest after each one. Grab a sip of water. We have those behind kicks, those crossover kicks behind. Push-ups again, then we're gonna do squat kicks, and then we're gonna run. So tacking on one more. Once we build the seven exercises, we're gonna work down. And we're gonna take one off, all right? Here we go, three, two, and one. Tap it out just to get the movement. Make sure you have it, you can stay here. Or if you want, you're gonna bring it up here with me. Let's move today, let's sweat it out. Oh, I know I'm ready. I'm a little tired, old mid. A little sore, a lot sore. I had a big day yesterday, but hey, moving through it today. Don't be scared to move a little bit when you are sore to work it out. You may not want to take it this high though, and keep it low. All right, here we go. Push up on the floor. Full push up, and you can do it from your knees or your toes. Push into that downward dog. Bring that leg up. Push, lift. That's it, keep alternating. We're adding on our squat kicks next. Woo! This will go fast today. As we tack on exercises and work back down. Three, two, and one. Here we go. Squat kicks. You're gonna squat, touch, squat, touch. You've got it. Squat, touch. Kick that leg up. Reach out and touch that toe. I'm using the same hand. Same leg or same toe. Woo, 10 seconds. Then we have those lateral runs. Uh, runs. Woo, good. Three, two, and one. Here we go. Quick to the side. Stick it. Good, you got it. Make sure you get the arms in there, okay? When we run, we move those arms. Don't hold them in and just move those feet. Get those arms and feet working together. Three, two, and one. Good, rest. All right, same exercises, but before we run, we're out on a burpee. I know, nobody likes burpees. This girl does, this lady does. Um, just cause it gets that heart rate up there without the running. <laughs> Makes you feel like you're in a sprint, right? They're gonna be a little different, but we'll, we'll go over that when we get there. Here we go. Kick, kick, take it low, take it high. Nice work. Let's move, 30 seconds here. Nice thing about these is we're never in one place too long before we move on. Huh, huh, you got it. Come on. Let's go, three, two, and one. Here we go, push-ups from the floor. Push-up, lift. Oh, I feel that lift. My bottom is on fire. <laughs> oh, from my strength yesterday workout. Oh, feels good though, feels good. Feels good to feel those muscles that we know we have, but we sometimes forget about. <laughs> good, push. You got it. Three, two, and one. Nice work. Here we go. Squat with me, toe touch. Kick it up. 
I might be quiet today. <laughs> Breathe it through this. We got it. It's gonna feel so good when we're done. This is what I focus on every day when I wanna make an excuse for myself. I said I'm gonna be beating myself up about it if I don't do it. Now I feel super good when I do finish. All right, here we go, burpee. I want you to jump it out or walk it out and stay low and do a little half turn here, jump turn. There you go, same thing, other direction. All right, you got it. We're gonna remain low if you want. Out, out, in, in. Open it up, back in. You can do it that way. All right, you do you, modify, find your challenge. Three, two, and one. The one we always end with, run. Good, come on, quick. We got it. Five seconds, come on. Hang in there, three, two, and one. Good. Always know, once we get through that, we're gonna have rest. We have seven exercises as our top one, which I think is not quite yet. We have six next. I think the most time we spend in a row working, it's either gonna be three or 3.30. Not bad if you can just get through that, okay? Ooh, breathing through the belly. We're getting ready to go here. Let's enjoy this rest. Five more seconds. We're adding a plank to this one. Here we go. Tap it out. I have to tap it first. <laughs> I need to make sure I have the movement. And then I want to bring it up. All right, a little coordination here, a little brain game, which is always good. Good. Come on, tap, tap. Keep moving. You can alternate between highs and lows as well to keep moving for 30 seconds. Do half of it high, half of it low. Three, two, and one. Here we go, back down, push-ups. Woo, push-up, lift. Push-up, lift. That's it. Remember, you can do a kneeling push-up and come to your toes and then lift as well. Modify if you need to, or break it down. It's the other way to modify today. Bring it down to just your push-up. Focus on that. All right, here we go, squat kicks. Squat, touch those toes. Get that leg up there. If you need to touch your shins, because that's where you are, it's okay. Find a point, find your challenge, and move. You got it, you can do it. 10 seconds here, and we have our burpees. And those burpees can be regular burpees as well. Three, two, and one. Here we go. Stay low, give it a little 90 degree turn. Oh, oh, there you go. Stay low, stay low, walk it out. Swing it open instead of hopping if you need to. It's a little switch of the hips. Uh, uh, back. You want to think of it that way. Three, two, and one. Here we go, plank hold. Let's go to those forearms. Elbows under shoulders. Hold it here. If you want to tap it out, make it tougher. Lift the legs and alternate. Maybe lift an arm. Please feel free to find your challenge there. Might be kneeling, hips down in line with the head. Woo, you do you, modify. Find your challenge. Three, two, and one. Here we go. We have those runs. Lateral runs, move your arms. Come on, come on. Pump those arms, work them with the legs. Time, woo, good work. 30 seconds rest. We're on our last big round. Seven exercises. 
all the way through. I think it's 3 or 3.30. <laughs> I'm not sure. Do your math. <laughs> all right, I can't think right now. The brain is going everywhere. The oxygen is going everywhere else. All right, the one we're gonna add onto this is a crossover knee hit, okay? Before that run. All right, here we go. Kick, 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 and bring it up if you're there. All right, feeling good. Endorphins are flowing. The sweat is coming. We've got this. It's a good day. Focus on the positive. Starting right here. You're on your fitness journey. You've tuned in, you're getting it done. Day three, you've got it. Three, two, one. Here we go, push-ups. Here we go, push-up, kick, or lift. Push-up, lift. It's a rear lift, really. Control it. Nice work. Keep alternating. Oh boy. Push. Had a lot of push-ups in these workouts lately. It's the only way to get better is to keep practicing. Three, two, and one. Bring it up, squat, kick. With that toe tap or some sort of tap, whether it's your shin, ankle, just reach. See how far you can get. Whew, good. Eight seconds here. You got it. Keep working. Woo, three, two, and one. Here we go, burpees. Down, little side turn here, a little hopper. Think about flipping those hips. Good, 90 degrees. Good. Again, feel free to break it down to just a regular burpee. Three, two, and one. Let's come down. Forearms, elbows under shoulders. Hold it here, bottom level, or tap it out. Or lift. You could do both. Have fun with it. I used to go to these fitness conferences and I love it. I had a special instructor and he would always say, come up with something on your own, some combination. Have some fun, make it your own. It will mean more to you. Good. Here we go. Cross any hit. Low, up on those toes, or with a jump. Cross, cross. It's a slight skip with a knee hit. Good. Good, you got it. Eight seconds, we're running. Three, two, and one. And I really encourage you, if you don't like this lateral movement, not to give up on it. Don't just run in place because that's what we do all the time in life. And in our cardio as we move forward, we stay very still and stationary. So I want you to move lateral. Yes, it takes some coordination and some thought, but you can do it, just slow it down. Three, two, and one. 30 seconds. Grab a sip. That was our full round, seven exercises. We're working down, this will go quick now. All right, I told you. I really try to write workouts that will go very quickly. Might give you a good punch. Not a real punch, but you know what I mean. All right, so now we're gonna take off those kicks. We're gonna actually take off the front part of it and work back since we spent less time on those end exercises. So push up is our first one. Here we go, three, two, and one. Push up, kick, or lift, sorry. I wanna say kick. Whatever makes you think straight on this, just remember it's not a kick out this way. It's more of a leg lift, straight leg. Woo, good. So starting with this push-up, working those other exercises we just did, then we'll drop the push-up. And we'll start whew, with our, our squat kicks here, okay? Here we go. Moving right in. 
and then our burpee. Good. Kick, come on. Lift that leg, get it there. You might have to lean back a little. Find that squat. Three, two, and one. All right, here we go, burpees. Down, right into it. No rest here until the end, until we're done with this, this segment here. Flip those hips, 90 degrees. Quick switch of the feet. Staying low. Come on, we got it. Three, two, and one. Cut to the ground, let's just stay here. Plank, here we go. Tap if you'd like, hold. You do you. Just make sure that if you're tapping, you're ready for it, that you're bracing. Those hips will level with the floor. Good. We got it. Three, two, and one. All right. Crossover. Knee. Take it low first. Get that movement. And then take it up onto those toes. And then if you want, try to get off those toes. Like a skip. A high skip. Right here. Three, two, one. Here we go. Run it out. Remember, I know this may feel strange. You may not feel comfortable like running in place, but work it. Get that mind-body connection. Coordination. It needs to challenge us, right? Three, two, and one. Good work. 30 seconds rest. Woo-wee. Feeling good? High five to you. Getting closer. Taking one more away. Yay. Who doesn't like that? Working up and back down. Little pyramid. All right. 10 seconds to go. We're going to start with that squat kick. Go into burpee. Go into plank. Cross. Crossover hits here. All right. Let's do it. Squat, kick. You got it. One less. Push ups are done for today. Woohoo! <laughs> All right. Unless you just love them. I love them, but they wear on you quick, right? Three, two, one. Burpees, here we go. Some sort of burpee. You can change it to whatever you would like. You can step it out and in. Stay low. Flip those hips. A little switch. Not much. Woo! Three, two, and one. All right, we're down to planks. Here we go, hips level with the floor, tap it out. Make sure those hips are level, that we're not up here or sagging in the lower back. Nice and level, elbows under shoulders. You got this. Three, two, and one, good. All right, cross it over and hit. Here we go, start low, get the movement. Trying to get that elbow outside that knee and then bring it up. We're so close, oh, there goes the sweat. Whew. It's not really sun visor weather here in Indiana, but in here, it could be. <laughs> and I love that feeling. Give me a sun visor every day. Three, two, one. All right, lateral runs. That's a mouthful. Here you go. 
台湾。If you have to march in place, I didn't say that. If you have to march or march it to the right or march it to the left, that's okay. Maybe you need to do that for your knees today. That's fine. Three, two, and one. Rest. Oh, great job. 30 seconds each time. Run, run, Rudolph. All right. So where are we starting? Burpees. Burpees are our first one here. Then plank. And then cross hit. And we'll keep changing it. Burpees. What a way to start here. But it's shorter, so you've got this. Let's do it. Three, two, and one. Here we go. At least it's not following the push-ups and the squat kicks. It's after rest. There's your positive outlook today. Burpees after rest. Good. Feels better already. Feels like I can do more. Good. A little switch of the hips. 90 degrees. You can turn and face the full wall. You can just switch the hips. All right, here we go. Plank hold. Back down. Hips level with the floor, elbows under shoulders. If you're ready, tap it out. Remember, you can modify to kneeling as well here. Just keep those hips in line with your head. And spine. So we're not boxed out up towards the ceiling. Woo! Three, two, one. All right, cross it over. Oh boy, let's go. It's working. I just need to wipe off here. Here we go, it's dripping. I forgot the waterfall today. Always working for the waterfall. Good. Cross it over, hit, hit. Get off those toes if you're there, or just pop up on the toes. Three, two, one. All right, a little run. Quick. Good. Come on. Three, two, and one. It's getting better. We're headed down. We'll have a little cool down stretch after. Breathe in. All right, start with those burpees. So we have the plank knee run. We'll have the crossover knee hit. Run. That's it. All right, 10 seconds here. Let me towel off. This is only, I can only count on, a, on my hand. <laughs> Number of times I've actually dripped since winter here. All right, what did I say we were doing here? Plank, plank down. <laughs> Sorry, got to talking. Let's not do that. Here we go. Hips in line with the floor, elbows under shoulders. We started with those burpees last time, we're at planks. We're gonna hit those knees, we're gonna run, and then we'll take it down again. Feels so good to come down after that high. Good, three, two, and one. All right, here we go. Cross it over, get that crossover. Try to get that elbow outside the knee, and then bring it up as much as you can. A little skip if you can get there today. If not, no worries. You're working, you're moving, you're here. Great job. 10 seconds, don't be hard on yourself. We're harder on yourself. People are hard on us. Let's be nice to ourselves in here. Three, two, and one. All right, run. Sorry, we gotta run. Good. Good, eight seconds. Three, two, and one. Two claps, high five to you. Whew. We're coming down, but the sweat is still coming. 
Good waterfall. All right, quick sip. Whew, 15 seconds, we only have two exercises. Knee and run, knee and run. Oh, I hope you have, hope that you have enjoyed this workout. If you have, come back and see us tomorrow. Here we go, cross it over. I like to start low. Make sure I have that movement and work up. Yeah, this is why I just run, no, swim. I do a lot of strength, but coordination, you know, it takes practice. There we go, come on. 13 seconds. Ooh, come on, get into it. Five, three, two, one. Here we go, running it out. You got it, this is the last one. Yay, come on, hang in there. 10 seconds is all you have. Three, two, and one. Excuse me, nice work. Walk it out. Ooh, about four minutes, we'll cool down here. Oh. Okay, let's get that heart rate down. Just walk it out if you need to. I like to breathe in through my nose, exhale through my mouth. Here we go in to get away from that chest breathing that we often do when we're out of breath or tired or just every day really anymore. Inhale and exhale. Good work. Inhale and exhale. Inhale. And exhale. Oh, good, that feels good. Let's go ahead, stand to the side here. I want you to open your arms out like airplane wings, nice and wide. I want you to fall forward into a tabletop, nice flat back parallel to the floor. Just reach out, get that head in line with the spine. Really extend, feel your spine getting longer and longer your go-go gadget here <laughs> and you're just gonna shoot out that way all right now let's fall down grab the back of those legs let that head fall down round it out here Ooh. sometimes I like to rub my hamstrings and give them a massage while I'm here let's reach down don't pull in too far just to feel that stretch Good work. I want you to bring those arms out wide. Come up standing. Let's bring that left foot forward, right foot back. Heel down, push into that front knee, feeling that stretch down the calf there. Good, now I'm gonna have you bend this knee and you're up on your back toes. Bend a little bit, tuck your tailbone, squeeze this glute, feel that stretch in your hip flexor. And then if you have the balance, I want you to come up and over and feel that stretch. If that's too much and, you're, and you're, it's hard to get that balance, come down to the floor and do that same stretch. Good, let's stand up, come out of it. Let's fall forward into another hamstring stretch here. Nice flat back, just bend, hinge over this straight leg. If you want, touch your toes, maybe you just touch your knee and that's enough to feel that stretch. Woo, good job. Let's turn to the other side. Left foot back, heel down, push into that right knee. Bend it a bit, push forward. So you feel that stretch in that back calf. Good, now bend that back knee just a bit. Feel that stretch. Good, now let's come up on the toes and bend down a little further in that knee. I want you to squeeze that outside that left glute, kind of tuck the tailbone just a bit, not too much, just so that we're not arching or leaning forward. There, no, no back bends, let's just say that, no back bends. Let's bring this arm up if you're there with your balance and reach back and over. 
If not, again, come and bring that knee to the floor so you can focus on that stretch. Good, come out of that. Ooh, let's go into our hamstring stretch. Again, nice flat back, kind of square your hips, hinge over that leg, not rounding out. Just find a place along the leg to rest or your toes. Side's a little tighter for me. Breathe. All right, that is it today. That is all the time we have. I don't want to keep you. I know that it's a busy time. This is why we have our challenge, our 12 days of fitness. And so hopefully you can really make an effort to fit it in. Even if you have to break up a workout into two sections, some of these can be done that way. All right, so if you have any comments or questions, let us know. And I hope to see you tomorrow and every day. Have a great day. Bye-bye.